This is Max Williams with United Real Estate, and today I'm in Western Henrico. Today we're going to take a look at a three bedroom, two and a half bath townhome. This townhome is located here in a gorgeous townhome community. It is well maintained. In fact, the grass crew is directly ahead cutting as we speak. The $165 a month HOA takes care of that and all exterior maintenance. This is a quiet community here and you see that the speed limit is eight miles an hour. Five was not enough and 10 was a little too much, so they came up with eight miles an hour. This unit is an end unit, and as a result, when new, it commands a premium. If you are ever in the market for a new townhome, you will notice that they're gonna charge you more for the end unit. End unit is nice because you have this additional space on the side and Typically, it is common space. It doesn't necessarily belong to the owner of the end unit, but they had that additional space. You don't have somebody on both sides. So let's go on in and see what this beautiful renovated townhome has to offer. Uh, there are some upgrades here I'm going to point out to you uh, that I haven't seen before. And so this home is truly unique. You may be wondering how this whole Verona, excuse me, Corona, pandemic is affecting real estate. And fortunately, the governor of Virginia has deemed real estate an essential service. So we are by and large conducting business with proper precautions as we were before. Our partner agencies, partner industries, uh, such as title and lending are considered under the financial services umbrella. And they also are considered essential businesses so they are working as normal and we are still buying and selling real estate there are people that are actively in the process of buying and selling uh, there are fewer buyers right now than normal so what that means is if you have been on the fence thinking about buying this may be a good time rates are definitely volatile so you want to keep an eye on them but in the big scheme of things, if there is reduced competition, that bodes well for buyers. So just something to keep in mind. Our market will typically pick up in the spring and summer. And if you can get a jump on all of that activity, it's definitely going to work out to your favor. OK, here in our beautiful kitchen, we have white shaker cabinets, stainless steel appliances. I love what they did here with this granite. This granite, we've seen this before, but we've got a cream base. There are hints of cherry, uh, a little bit of tan, a little bit of gray, all mixed in here with this beautiful species. Really, really nice. Someone pointed out to me before, we've got Edison light bulbs. Edison light bulbs, I really like the look that they brought into this home. Our stainless steel dishwasher directly ahead. We've got space there at the bar for about three chairs. So you could probably get three chairs there with no problem. Nice, open, open floor plan. This, of course, is going to be our additional uh, dining area. You could use this area actually a couple different ways, uh, but it's nice because it's open to the kitchen. Great place for entertaining. And I really like what we have back here in the back of the townhome. I've been in countless numbers of uh, this style townhome, and this is the first time I've seen a deck this big. This is a huge, huge new deck. On the side, we do have a sloped grade here. And I'm going to show you here from the side uh, how that looks. Uh, still enough space for a four-legged friend to, to get down there and get some exercise. Uh, but just a, a massive space here. Uh, even with our current social distancing, you could probably still get a good dozen people back here uh, as long as you guys are safe keep your distance and still have a good time okay our detached storage got some shelving on that side and some bike hooks on this side there would be no need for a lawn mower or lawn and garden tools here because of course the hoa takes care of all of that for you one of the big big benefits that a lot of people love townhome living for is they don't have to worry about that. This is an excellent location. We're here in Henrico. We've got a lot of retail in the area, a lot of 
uh, dining options and uh, just a super, super convenient space. Uh, schools, very well respected in this area as well. Here to the right is going to be our laundry, the washer and dryer do convey conveniently located right there. One thing I wanted to point out, this is very important. These are lines that go to the washing machine, both hot and cold. Uh, the red obviously is the hot and the blue is the cold. But more importantly, these are steel braided. The standard or the builder grade material for them is rubber. Rubber over time breaks down. Rubber will eventually burst and typically those hoses will burst when you're on a seven day vacation. You'll come back to a nice moist experience. So it's important to spend a little bit extra money, get the steel braided hoses. You won't have to worry about the longevity of them and just a much better product. Okay, this home does heat water with gas and there is our tank. We're gonna transition upstairs now. One thing I wanted to point out, I didn't mention this to you before. We've got three speakers in the wall and then we have our jacks right there. And in the ceiling, we actually have additional speakers. Someone came in after this home was built and put uh, that in. That was not something that was provided by the builder, but it makes it really nice because now you don't have to worry about substandard sound for your AV system. And uh, you can make a nice little home theater right there in the front. Okay, new carpet, new paint. This home is ready to go. Uh, I was thinking earlier, I dealt with a really nice family from California. Uh, and they closed, uh, actually they moved in just a few weeks ago. And we did a lot of our work uh, online before they got here. They did their loan application, everything was set. We narrowed down the homes and then when they came, uh, we spent a day or two looking at homes that they had narrowed down and they ultimately made their decision. Uh, the beauty of technology, a lot of agents now are looking at technology because showing homes is a little dicey. So I've been doing this obviously for years, but it really helps if you're transitioning from out of town, because if you're a pre-qualified buyer and you're transitioning in, I can go into a home, your short list, three or four homes and do video tours just like this for you. So when you hit the ground, you already have seen exactly what is here and it can make your transition much more efficient. I'm dealing with another family right now from Canada and uh, we're trying to look at the different options for them and uh, definitely using this technology to our advantage. Okay, this is going to be our hall bath. I like what they did here because they brought in the same granite, the same shaker cabinets up here that they used in the kitchen. We do have a fiberglass tub shower enclosure and I love the design of this shower head. This is a curved design and here with the lever in position one, all of these jets here are activated. When you flip it over to position two, you get a more vigorous stream from just those jets. So really, really smart, modern design on that shower head. We're gonna transition now into our master suite. Here in the master, we've got nice vaulted ceilings, just makes it feel nice and open. Uh, along with the bright walls and the light that flows in. There's enough space in here easily for a king size bed and adult furniture with no problem. The home is wired for an alarm system. Once again, we've got that ceiling fan. It's moving a good amount of air here in this bedroom. This is our master bath. Plenty of space there on that vanity. Additional storage at the bottom tile floor. This one's going to have a stand-up shower and I like that we have our dual shower head technology. This one is of course detachable. Uh, the human body is not flat. It has many different curves and crevices and this is amazing to change the trajectory of your stream as needed for maximum hygiene. 
and uh, I'm just really impressed with that there. I guarantee you, you will not watch another home tour today and they talk about shower head, stream, and velocity, and all of those good things that I feel are just so very, very important. Okay, that's going to do it for this beautiful home. If you have questions about this or any other home in the market, it would be my honor to help. I can be reached on Facebook under Richmond Area Foreclosures, on YouTube under my name, Max Williams Realtor. Please be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. And uh, just keep in mind that we're not going to be in this situation forever. I know it may be stressful. I know it may be uncertain, but uh, we're going to be through this. I'm trying to maintain some normalcy. And I appreciate you guys for hanging in there with me on this tour. Thanks so, so much. Have a great day.